Sunday, everyone. I'm Kisa Lindbergh, delivering your weekly Shiloh announcements. But first, let me just say, I hope everyone is okay after Hurricane Ida, and the recovery process is going to take time, but we will get through this together. For those of you who still need help, please note the following links on the screen that may provide relief. Because of the recent storm, there's no new adult Sunday school lesson today, but the notes may be found on our website, shilohbr.com. Feel free to catch up on previous lessons taught by Pastor Smith, available on our media platforms. Preschool and Youth Department Sunday School is still available through Zoom at 9.45 a.m. Be sure to contact any of the email addresses listed on the screen for further information. During these trying times, it's important to remember we have a friend in Jesus, and prayer is a universal language to reach him. Each Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6 a.m., our very own Reverend Emmanuel Smith and Minister Rodney Johnson light up your mornings with prayer by phone. We also offer an evening prayer call every day at 6.05 p.m. with Pastor Fred Jeff Smith. So, just to recap, you can start and end your day with prayer. Now, just how awesome is that? Call 425-436-6377 and enter the code 337747 for this amazing experience. We are entering our second week of prayer and fasting. If you would like to participate in this activity and you're medically able, then join us each day from 6 a.m. to noon as we pray for those affected by the earthquake in Haiti, those affected by Hurricane Ida, and several other tragedies that have happened in recent weeks. We appreciate everyone who continues supporting our ministries with their stewardship. Shiloh is blessed with the opportunity to help the community and your giving makes that possible. Just a reminder, the church office will be closed tomorrow in observance of the Labor Day holiday. This concludes this week's announcements. So take care of yourself, take care of each other. I'm Kiesel and Bird, signing off.